Hey guys, welcome back to our latest tip and hint. And today we're going to be talking about pre and post workout supplements and why it's important that you take them. So let's talk a little bit about the subject about pre and post um, supplements, pre and post workout supplements, why it's important for all people to, uh, to do it. Um, there, one, one thing that there's no way for us to get around is there's no way for if you are um, trying to lose weight, for instance, or if you are um, an athlete, almost always in order, well, let's say first to lose weight, you always have to be in a calorie deficit in order to lose weight, which means you have to expend more calories than you're taking in so your body will lose weight, and there's no way to get around that. Now, one of the things that's very important is that when you're in a calorie deficit, meaning you're taking in less calories than what you're consuming, which is causing your body to burn stored body fat, causing your body, or sometimes muscle, causing your body to lose weight. When you're in that calorie deficit, calories are obviously foods that you take in. Well, other things that cause you to be in a deficit is you're also in a nutrient and you know mineral vitamin deficit as well, not only calorically, but also nutrient-wise too. Now, nutrients, there are two different types of nutrients that we want to talk about. There's macronutrients, and there's also micronutrients. Macronutrients are what most of us know about. Calories, um, proteins, carbohydrates, fats, sugars, you know, all those are macronutrients, large nutrients. Now, there are micronutrients, what we call micronutrients, things that can't be uh, calculated with a caloric value or, a, or necessarily, like for instance, when you have 15 grams of protein, that has a caloric value to it. Micronutrients can't be assessed by a caloric value. Things, you know, vitamin A, C, D, amino acids, um, all of that don't have a caloric um, value that's put to them. And those are just as important to get into your system as a macronutrient. So one of the things that we talk to a lot of clients about is we have to come to the reality that we have to burn more calories than what we take in in order to lose weight. So it's either we have to restrict our calories, how much we're taking in, or we have to expend more calories through our exercise. But the end result is we are going to be in a calorie deficit, which also is going to put us in a nutrient um, deficit. So if we are trying to lose weight, it is very important for us to take in a supplement, supplements that have nutrients in them, not necessarily calories, but things that have added nutrients. Because if we're in a caloric deficit, but we have a nutrient surplus, our chances of maintaining our lean muscle mass, maintaining our strength, our tone in our body is going to be much greater. Where if you're in a caloric deficit and a nu and nutrient de um, deficit as well, the likelihood of your body burning muscle and losing muscle is also higher. Now, I did, I did a uh, study on this several times. Several years ago, I was using a product by Beverly International called Muscle Synergy. It's an NO product, and the design of it is ultra recovery. It's, 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 it's immune system support. It helps with recovery. I took it triple what the recommendations were, um, and I also had a very, very calorically restricted diet. And I wanted to see what happened, and I didn't lose muscle during that time. And the reason was is that all of my, although my cal calories were restricted, my nutrients were in overload. Remember, most of your nutrients don't have a caloric value to them, so you can be calorically restricted, but yet have a lot of nutrients in your system, and it can help preserve, protect, even sometimes build muscle when you're in a calorie deficit. So, and also, you know, your body is under a lot more stress. It uses more nutrients. It depletes more things in your system pre you know during your workout so feeding your body not not only is it important to feed your body with extra nutrients throughout the throughout the day but if your body is expending the most amount of nutrients during workout time it's very important that you feed your body before working out so it can feed off of those nutrients instead of stored muscle or and after your workout you're then replenishing it with nutrients that have been lost during the workout. And this is for all levels. So if you're an extreme athlete, if you're an extreme bodybuilder, if your calories are ultra-restricted, then yeah, we can take in a lot of different supplements. We can 
take in high levels of supplements, but even if you're just a beginner, even if you're just starting, it's a good idea to not only take nutrients throughout the day, but it's also good to take nutrients in pre and post training. If you're just a sedentary person, those one a day vitamins that are a joke, those are good for people who don't do anything. But if you're active, if you're busy, if you have a hard job, if you're exercising, working out, playing sports, your body is tapping into the nutrients that you have. And if you're in a calorically restricted diet because you're trying to lose weight, it's even worse. You become even more nutrient deficient and therefore the need to take in extra nutrients is very important. So I you know I I hope that I hope that is a a good tip for you guys as far as why it's important to take in nutrients. And you're like, okay, which ones do we want to take in? I'm going to show you a couple examples really quick. Um, you know, some different nutrients. Of, of course, you have your standard, you know, multivitamin. Um, you can take in, you know, um, the Beverly International has a pack that we recommend called the Super Pack, which has all of them. You can take a one, you know, one of these um, multivitamins from what we're showing from Dot Fit. We usually recommend two to four a day. That's something that you can take in throughout the day, which covers a lot of your vitamins and mineral bases. Um, other things, and I'm showing you Dot Fit products. Uh, Beverly makes Beverly International makes wonderful products too that we recommend. Even you know something that another product that we recommend very highly for people from a nutrient standpoint are antioxidants. You know antioxidants. Whenever you're exercising and working out, the more stress that your body is under, the more free radicals it releases, and that can cause some significant issues. We don't really have time to get into that, but it, there can be significant issues with more free radical release. So. Antioxidants are something that show that help to fight a lot of the free radicals and can really help with immune system support and recovery from exercise and a lot of preventative things with illness and so forth. But an antioxidant, in addition to a multivitamin, is really good to take. And taking an antioxidant pre and post training um, is you know really good. So just even doing those two in your fitness routine if you're just starting off is a really good thing. Now for a little more advanced, I have some extra things that we can look at. Um, there are many different products on the market. This is just one. Muscle Defender, which is a glutamine product. Glutamine is great for recovery. And, you know, this pre and post workout to help your body recover from, you know, exercise is, is very, very helpful. Um, in addition to that, uh, this is an amino acid product. Branch chain amino acids, which can, you know, certainly help out with recovery as well, too. Um, you know, obviously, if you're not very active, if you're not working out, these products probably aren't that necessary for you, but if you're active, you're working out, you're going through hard workouts, then taking things that are going to help your body recover to help fuel and put in some of those nutrients that you're losing so you're not in a nutrient deficit when you're calorically restricted is going to help you a lot. Um, and also, if you use Beverly, you know, these two products from DotFit are great. Beverly makes a product called Glutamine Select, which combines these two products together. It is glutamine plus branch chain amino acids. And it's a wonderful product to take pre and post training. Um, of course, another staple pre and post training is creatine. Um, this particular product by uh, Dot Fit is creatine, beta alanine, and uh, glutamine all together. And so, you know, in the things that it says on here, it you know you can be in a caloric deficit, still increase lean muscle mass. Um, it, it definitely helps with muscular and strength endurance. Um, it helps with fatigue and definitely with recovery. And of course, you can take in, this is a, an NO product, uh, which, which is fueled with caffeine and other things to help fuel your workouts pre-workout. There's also a lot of other good nutrients that are in it that are usually depleted, um, such as potassium and sodium and other things that are good to take pre and post-workout um, that, that can definitely help your recovery abilities. But no matter what you choose, if it's one product or all of the products, the most important thing to remember is even though your, your body is in a caloric deficit, it also means that your body's in a nutrient density. So if you want to lose weight, we're going to have restricted calories, but we want to make sure we eat, take in a surplus of nutrients to make sure you recover from your exercise. I hope that helps you. Contact us, us with any questions and we can help push you along to the right supplements that are going to help you in a pre and post workout stage that are going to be the right ones for you specifically. You feel there's something wrong I'll shelter you and keep you warm I'll never let you walk alone I